just wanted you to know that you are in fact my favorite son. So don't go tell me other siblings. Thanks, Pops. Hey, what's up, brothers? Gotta all tell you about a dream I had. Yeah? What about? You're acting a little suspicious or whatever. It was nothing much. It was just a crazy dream. I was drooling over y'all, but I can't tell you nothing more. <laughs> son, I need to go to Shetchum and check on your siblings and flock. Alright, son. <laughs> We gotta do something about this, y'all got it? We can't let this Joseph or whatever dictate us. Y'all, since we all hate this guy, killing him would be way too easy. Why don't we put him in a pit and have all the animals eat him? Nah, nah, nah. That's too easy. I don't want to see this fool no more. I say we send him far and sell him to the Ishmaelites. Hey guys. Yo, Pops, we got some bad news for you. What happened? What you mean? Pops, Joseph is dead, and we found this. After all these years of working for him, I ain't never gonna disrespect him. Joseph, my loyal servant, I will be leaving for a while. You are in charge. Dang, boy, you fine. You looking good. Miss, what you mean? That's very disrespectful to your husband. Truly trusted has broke thy promise. Thee shall go away. Servant, take him away to never see him again. Joseph, from today onwards, you will be in charge of the king's cupbearer and baker. Returning to hot power. And Baker, your dream is about you dying. Sorry, dog. Your Majesty, I remember so 
everyone who can translate your dreams. Call him. Okay, so according to your dream, you're gonna have seven years of prosperity, then another seven years of famine. You gotta be careful, bruh.